Giving the heat a battle or something, and I'm getting screwed over because of that. That would suck ass. Ooh, he got hit in the head with a knife. Ugh, he, he cut his knees. He was like, "Give me your kneecaps," and he went down. Oh, I'm dead. Man, those ain't mer. I mean, those ain't Navy Seals. I'm a Navy SEAL. They don't even yell Navy SEALs. That's what you're supposed to do. If he would have yelled that, Vamp would have probably ran. Yes, that's Vamp diving around the damn place. Look at him. Look even gayer. He is twirling. Look at just twirling. Cutting him up. You got cut up by a fairy, dude. I'd be pissed. The other dude just got, like, the knives thrown in him. You straight up, he just twirled on you. Bloop, you done. Squirt that Quentin Tarantino stuff right there. Wait, why is it not squirting? What the fuck? Do I have blood turned off or some shit? When he got his neck slit, it should have been squirting like, like, you know, Quinn, like, Kill Bill style. I think I, why, why would, why is the blood turned off? Well, there is blood on the wall, but I mean blood turned off as in no one squirts blood when they get hit. He should have been squirting. What the hell? Did I'm mad. That shit is funny. He squirts like a fountain, like somebody is squeezing ketchup. And now he's feeling him up in the corner, like a fruit. Ugh, you saw that smoke come out of his mouth? He got that hot ass breath. And then he's got the dick knife. Yep, that's vamp for you. Five today. Or rather, six. You were fucking gay. Vamp, when he eats people, he marks it off on his chest, and since he can heal, he'll just heal it up the next day. Ryden, what are you doing? You that sl Ugh, hot breath. He is tearing up at him. On the roof. Ugh. His breath is hot. He starts dancing. Whoop, twirl. Yeah. He's like a ballerina. Yes, but wait till I tell you what I found. Something interesting? I'll tell you a person. Where are you? In the central unit with the president. Be right there. Watch him start dancing again. Oh, shit. Oh! Yeah. Leaping. He's gone. Hold on. How you gonna aim the gun at him Calm now? Down. 
My name is... My name is Pliskin. Iroquois Pliskin. Lieutenant Junior Grade. Who names their son Iroquois? Yeah, you already know who that is. If you don't, you're probably either blind or retarded. Are you a Navy SEAL? No, I take that back. Because you can hear his voice. How did you get in? You're either deaf, Astro blind, from a Navy or chopper. just plain stupid if you don't know who he is. Ugh, a roach came out his ass. You saw that? Have I seen you before? That suit. Yep. Are you Foxhound? They should have gave Raiden an assless right. suit. I would have been dying. Disbanded. Just like the village people. Where were you butt cheeks is out. Delta Force? <laughs> I was part of the Army's Force 21 trials. Force 21? That's about tactical IT deployment, right? Any field experience? No, not really. So this is your first? I've had extensive training, the kind that's indistinguishable from the real thing. Like what? Sneaking mission 60, weapons 80, advanced VR, huh? But yeah, all these clips that they're showing are from the uh, PS1 game Metal Gear, Metal Gear Solid VR missions. It's that's all it is, just hundreds of VR missions. a few soldiers die in field exercises. There's pain sensation in VR and even a sense of reality and urgency. The only difference is it isn't actually happening. That's the way they want you to think, to remove you from the fear that goes with battle situations. Well, you got lit up. Game. What better way to raise the ultimate soldier? All those snakes running in place. So yeah, those were all from uh, the PS1 game VR missions. It's not that good of a game. Unless so you're, you're like a that super VR duper Metal Gear kind of fan, which I am, but I still don't have it because I never like VR missions. Right. And a game on? only VR missions, I'm good. Navy SEAL 10 is dead. No, a single survivor. But I do enjoy the VR missions on this game. Because on this game, you get different costumes and you can run around as riding butt ass president? naked. Looks like they took him somewhere else. And it's funny because, like,. You said there Wouldn't was you be scared if you just saw some ass naked girly dude yeah. just run by you? Lieutenant like, what J. the fuck? I'd probably start crying. I'd just go into face? a corner, what? I'd sit down, this ball up, you know, mission. crawl into a little ball, no and just cry. It's a little too late for that. What's up? Take a look. He looks like he's taking a nap. But he's dead. What the hell? A Navy captain. Uh. You all right? Give me a few minutes. Must have lost a few more pints than I thought. What was that man just now? That blood-sucking freak. That was Vamp. He's Romanian, a wizard with knives, as you saw. The way he moved didn't seem human. You won't see that in VR, I guarantee. What is he? One of the members of Dead Cell. He looks like a Dead Spanish Cell. ballerina. Him? A special forces unit created by ex-president George Sears. The name was originally intended to reflect its anti-terrorist functions. The unit would launch unannounced assaults on government complexes for the ultimate terrorism simulation. They were needed to show VR troopers like you how to deal with the real thing. But around the time their original leader died in prison, the unit began to unravel. They were always close to the edge, but they became more and more extreme, began to go after U.S. allies, even civilians. We estimate that no fewer than a hundred people died as a result of accidents the dead cell arranged on their own. They were out of control, and it all came to a head six months ago. What happened? The unit was devastated. There are only three left now, and you just saw one of them. Why would they go after the big shell? How should I know? I told you they were on the lunatic fringe. What about their leader? He says he's Solid Snake. Snake died two years ago. No, he ain't you, fucking Snake. The incident that Big Shell necessary in the first place? Right, and he was the one that sank that tanker. But he's a legend. Legends are usually bad news. There's not a lot of difference between heroes and madmen. You're saying Snake is still alive?